Hey OJ here. It's cooking time. So today we're gonna make a rhubarb crisp. You know I I don't know if I told you but I like rhubarb. Just in case I didn't tell you, I love rhubarb. Anyways, we've got uh, four cups of rhubarb here. We're just gonna dump this all into there. So that. Then I have a quarter cup of flour, half cup of sugar. So we're just gonna dump that in there. get all the sugar because we need all the sweetness. Then we're going to put a half a teaspoon of uh, cinnamon. If I can ever get my fingers in there. Well, you know what? We're just going to go like this because it's not working. There we go. Big fingers, I tell you. So I just mix this all together. Make sure it's all nicely mixed. So, if you hear that rumble in the background, for you who don't, haven't followed many of my videos, that's my dog Hurley. He loves to snore. And he just snores and snores and snores. He can snore with his eyes open. So, now that we've uh, got that all done there, we're going to take our little pan here. And we're going to start putting some stuff in here. I'm going to make sure we don't uh, put too much in it where it's all going to end up in the bottom of my oven. I think we'll fit her in there. There we go. Okay. Now we're going to mix our topping up. So I've got uh, one cup of flour. We've already pre-measured all this so you didn't have to painfully watch me measure things. Now we got uh, three quarters of a cup of brown sugar and a half a cup of oatmeal and a half a cup of uh, margarine or butter. We're using butter because we love butter. Butter's better for you anyway. And we've already pre-melted it. So. so now we got in there, we'll mix this all up. Okay, that should be almost good enough. So now we are going to uh, start spreading this all over the top. Just kind of put that all across there. Oh, this is going to be so good. So good. Did I mention it's going to be really good? I sure hope so. And it goes good with cream or it goes good with ice cream. We're planning on ice cream because I just went and bought a gallon of ice cream. So, how's that look? Doesn't that look amazing? Just amazing? Yes. Oh. Now we're going to pop her in the oven and uh, we have the oven set at 375 and in uh, 35 minutes we'll be tasting something. Hmm. Well, there it is. She's done. Oh, you should just smell. You know what? I'm not sure if we're going to share with anybody. But I think we're going to have to let this cool off a bit. And then, uh, then we'll have a little taste test. And then you guys can drool over my rhubarb crisp. Well, we scooped a small little helping out for me and we got some ice cream on the side because it goes really good with ice cream, especially when it's just hot out of the oven. Well, oh my.
Can you smell it? Mm. Can you smell it? Oh my. Not bad. Mmm. Oh yeah. Now, you gotta keep this recipe. Put it in the descriptions. But, mmm, this is good. Do you wanna just sit and watch me eat this whole thing? Mmm. Mmm, mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Gonna have to start dancing doing these things or something. Instead of just sitting down dancing. But, anyways, try it out. Let me know if you try it out. And uh, it's worth a, it's worth a taste test. Anyways, leave me a comment and leave me a like. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Mm. So good.